So before we get into uh, today's video, I just want to apologise about the background noise. My sister decided to be a bit louder than I thought it was, and I did ask her to turn it down, but she did the average teenage thing, slammed the door on my face, and screamed saying, life's not fair. So I do apologise, but try and just focus on the main video, and you will enjoy it. Thank you. So it's been a couple of days people, welcome your faces back to a new vlog today, hope you're having a fantastic day, it is good to be back, um, I do apologise I haven't uploaded in a couple of days, I wanted to kind of do a vlog, um, but I've just literally not had anything interesting happening in the last couple of days, which I've been trying to make interesting things happen, but nothing interesting has been wanting to happen. Um, it's just January, man. January is just a very tough month overall for everything, creativity-wise. Because um, everyone's just getting over the Christmas period. And I'm really suffering with this Christmas period uh, after after kind of period. Um, because it's kind of like you're just spending all of Christmas kind of relaxing. And that relaxing is just kind of carried over to now. Um, and it's like, I want to do stuff. In my brain, it's like, I want to do stuff. But my body's to say no. So it's kind of like being at a fight kind of war with the last couple of days so I haven't really done anything interesting I went to the cinema which was pretty much the only thing I did on my days off and record videos literally that's it that's all I've been doing um, so vlog material wise it was not interesting at all um, even though most of my vlogs do consist of me just doing them things but this week it wasn't that worthy of recording so uh, i thought this week um how could we do a vlog um i thought why not do a q a um so we're gonna be doing the q a today um and just kind of update you what i've been up to um but recently I, myself i went to the cinema saw two movies in a week which is insane i know um what saw um the newest Assassin's screen movie um which was very very disappointing i'd give that like a four out of ten very very disappointing um do you know, I played the Assassin's Creed a long time now, and, uh, well, I played it since number one and played it until uh, the Syndicate was the last one, I think it was, I think it was, or the last one that just came out, where it was in London, so, I played it up to then, and it was it'd been okay, the second one was still my favourite, um, and it looked really good, the trailer, the trailer looks solid, um, but... When you watch the movies, nothing compared to the games at all. Um, it's barely no action, and it spends more time in the in like like the pre. It doesn't really spend a lot of time in the past. It spends more time in the present, sort of thing. So it's like fifteen percent of the film is spent in t back in t in the past, then like eighty five percent of the time in the in t like in in, in, the, in the present. So I was like, oh, really disappointed by that, and. Uh, didn't enjoy it at all so that got like a 4 out of 10 but to see Rogue, Ro Rogue One which was very very good I did enjoy Rogue One um, if you're a fan of Star Wars recommend going and watch it if you're not a fan of Star Wars just don't waste your time uh, because you will hate it and the people I went with they weren't really massive Star Wars fans so they walked out and just went but for me, I'm a fan of Star Wars, so I enjoyed it. Um, and I do recommend, if you do go see, watch, uh, go see Rogue One, um, watch Rogue One, then get home and watch the first hour, 45, no, say the first 45 minutes of A New Hope, um, because it kind of links together, and it's kind of like, oh my god, I love that kind of how it connects and everything like that. Oh, so good. Um, I haven't had that in a film ever, so I like the fact it kind of connected very well at the end um, and there's an awesome scene with Darth Vader <laughs> great scene um, but other than that I'm not going to spoil it anymore um, but that was good um, but um, let's get to the most important thing why this the title of this vlog um, question time so let's get into the questions and answers so a couple of days ago I put a tweet out asking you guys for some uh, questions on the Twitters. If you don't follow me on Twitter, you can find it in the description down below. Um, and I've got a couple of questions here, some interesting ones and some kind of okay. Um, but I'm going to try my best to answer sensible ones and not think rude. Um, and uh, give you my response. Uh, my first question is uh, from a Dom. Um, question is, uh, when are you doing mobile streams? Um, so I've recently discovered you can start doing mobile streams on your phone. So it's kind of like these vlogs, but on mobiles. So it's like, obviously you've got Facebook Live, you've got uh, Periscope, is it? I think it's called, uh, where you can stream on that. Um, and Twitch have got one now, um, where you could broadcast live stream on Twitch. So it's kind of like, oh, 
So it's something I've looked into. I've got the app on my phone, but it's only in alpha, so it's not really good. So I can't see like a chat, but I believe Twitch are going to be releasing an app this year um, where you can actually stream off your phone and read the chat at the same time. So it's going to be an official Twitch stream app. So you could stream like out on the go, like the phone and all that stuff and talk to people with a chat. So I'm going to wait until that comes out before it does it, but I do plan on doing... It, we have to let me know which one you would prefer. I think Periscope would probably be the best one. Uh, but would you rather uh, think it's Periscope or Facebook Go? Because I do have a Facebook page as well, which I never use. So let me know in the comments down below which one would you prefer, Periscope or Facebook. What is your most embarrassing gaming moment? The uh, question is from uh, the nerdy uh, magic, magic, uh, iron, magican, magican, I believe that is how you pronounce it. Um, my, fa my most embarrassing moment. I actually had to think about this before I actually um, read the question and I probably would have to say in the last like two years, I have a lot of embarrassing moments. Every time I play a game, I'm just terrible at them, so. I'd say my most embarrassing moment would have to be... I'd probably say Black Ops 3. I played an online match when I was live streaming on Twitch. And I got 12 kills and 100 deaths. I think I might have that picture on my phone. Give me a moment. Yep, I've got it. I've got it here. If you can see that, if it focuses. 12 kills. You can see over there. 12 kills, 100 deaths. My most embarrassing moment of gaming in the last couple of years. That was really... I normally do terrible. But that's the worst I've ever done. And my next question is from a nicotine PVP. Um, do you uh, scratch and sniff? <laughs> All the time. And the next question is from a uh, hybrid gamer, uh, Ryan. Um, if you could change one thing about yourself, what would it be? I don't know. I'm pretty happy with my general self, uh, how I've kind of grown up and everything like that. Um, if I could change one thing about myself, is be more fitter. I'm very, very lazy. So if I could change one thing, I'd be more healthy. It's like be more athletic. But uh, gaming does that to everyone. So you all become unfit eventually. So yeah, I enjoy gaming and uh, stuff like that. But if I could change one thing, I'd rather be, I uh, really would love to be athletic and all that stuff. Next question is uh, from a Gary86, um, a dash, uh, dash, uh, under, under dash thing, I don't have a clue what it is. Um, what's uh, the best advice that you can give to a small stream uh, such as myself? And what's the best advice you've ever given, ever given? Ooh, or, or be, being given, sorry. Um, right, that's a very, very good one. Uh, the best advice I would give to a small stream patience patience is very key it's the same for a youtube channel i've literally just made a video on my gaming channel talking about how to grow your channel um also my main channel this channel's got over 200 subs which is incredible uh, but my gaming channel's got 12 thousand subs um i would say go and watch that video um it's like it's a long video 35 minutes but i do try to cover every single topic um literally just put it on in the background and listen and do some whatever you're doing um, and I just give my general advice and that would be patient have a schedule um, and don't expect things to happen as quick so like I've been doing YouTube now for seven years so I know the tricks and not tricks to use um, and don't expect it's, it's, it's a lot of a grind it's a big grind so it's kind of like go and watch our video i talk about it very in depth um and it's mainly aimed for youtube but you can re I, it's kind of the same with you twitch as well so go and watch our video i recommend it because i give all the tips and all that on how to like generally grow yourself as a content creator and my next question is uh from uh hell hell louis you I think that's how you pronounce it, but it's, that's his name now, that's correct. Um, ha hi, how are you? I'm very well today, buddy. How are you doing today? I'm doing very well, I just got off work. So, I'm going to record this, play some games, and uh, watch House Kitchen. So, I'm looking, I'm feeling pretty content, you know, pretty content. Right, so here I have three questions back to back, but I was like, okay, okay, okay. I, I, I like to do these because these are kind of funny questions. Um, what's the worst nightmare you ever had? I'll probably say the worst nightmare I've ever had. Well, actually, I think everyone does get this. It's like when you sleep 
and then you, you have like a like you're getting shot or something like that, you're getting killed, and then you wake up, there's that falling sensation. Um, I would say that's the worst nightmares I always have because I always feel that that kind of feel like you, that falling motion stays with me for that day. So I have a terrible day because I just feel my body's just constantly feels like that. So that's the worst nightmares I I've had, and happens every once in a blue moon but when they do happen oh don't like it only it tends to happen if i watch like horrors so i shouldn't really watch horrors but i like horrors um if you could uh, punch one person who would it be oh this is a very powerful question you <laughs> i'm joking i'm joking i'm joking i'm joking uh just had a, a user as well it's a tip tip her a fish um brad um not you not you um one person one person i really russell brand russell brand brand i hate him so much that'd probably be one person De yeah definitely him i really hate him but i'm gonna reword this the way he put it if i c if you could hug anybody in the world who would it be um i would hug you i would hug you brad why not I'm, I'm i'm in a good mood because i i had to reword that because what you put was not suitable for this vlog so i'm not putting that um but that is all the questions that uh, we got asked uh, this week if you hopefully you did enjoy this um it's like a little bit different uh, on the channel um and it's kind of like fun i do enjoy doing the q a's man they, they are good fun um if you do want to see more of these kind of things like every once in a blue moon leave a like on the video don't forget to subscribe and turn on the channel notifications for new vlogs um next week we do pl i do plan on like getting out and stuff like that um literally this week literally that's done nothing so um i will be back on the average kind of vlog kind of grind just kind of doing things um and i do have an awesome video planned as well next week um to discuss more more of a personal issue with me um which i want to share with you because i find i typed this on youtube the other day um and there's not many videos talking about a certain topic so i want to talk about it from me to you and kind of get it kind of more out there and there's nothing we should hide or be embarrassed about i don't think people are embarrassed by it but it's something i think we should be more open about so something worth keeping an eye out for next week um so hopefully you have enjoyed leave a like subscribe have an awesome day guys and i'll see you later on bye bye